With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. So the question is polymerization involves various mechanism depending upon the initiator. If initiator generates free radical addition polymerization takes place through free radical mechanism. If H plus is initiator and electron releasing group is present, cationic polymerization takes place. And if electron withdrawing group is present and KNH3 is initiator, anionic polymerization takes place. Which of the following will induce anionic polymerization? And the options are KNH2, N-butanilium, KOH, and fourth option is all of this. As we know that in anionic polymerization, initiator mechanism follows that initiator should be electron donating. So what we can write here in anionic polymerization initiator should be electron donating. And if we look all the options and if we go through all the options, our first option is KNH2. KNH2. So in KNH2, we will see that N have free electron to donate. So this can be followed by anionic polymerization. Or second option is N butanily butyl lithium. Butyl lithium. So N butyl and lithium so what we can write here if we break those it will break into butyl group and lithium plus so in butyl group we also can see that there are free electrons to donate so these also can follow anionic polymerization and our third option is potassium hydroxide koh as we know that oxygen are free electron to donate so these also follow anionic polymerization because all this have or all this initiator are electron donating so our correct answer for this question will be option number fourth all of this thank you for class 6 to 12 itg and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today